Okay guys, so what we're going to talk about is progress tracking. And I suppose the first thing to mention is whatever gets measured gets managed. So we want to use your body weight, body fat, the food that we're consuming in our training sessions as a measuring tool in order to make sure we're making progress towards our goal. So it's fairly simple. So the first thing is that there's no, I suppose, silver bullet. There's no magic um to any of this type of stuff if we are going in the right direction we will see it in terms of our numbers our body fat's going to be coming down our body weight is going to be coming down if we are not going the right direction in terms of our food then we'll know that we need to tweak and change things okay so it's as simple as this you know i kind of like to use this analogy the first thing to do is plan the hunt then hunt the hunt and review the hunt so what the hell do i mean by that Obviously, we've given you guys a plan in terms of nutrition, all right? So the nutrition plan is really, really simple to the point that most people think that that's not going to work. It needs to be more complicated than that. Listen, simple works every single time, but simple only works when you actually follow the plan. So that's what we mean by hunt to hunt. And we need to do that for at least a week 10 days before we can make any changes and alter things give your body a little bit of time to adapt and then obviously every sunday we need to review what's gone the week before okay now the quicker you can get on this the better because if you leave it a week or two weeks or three weeks before you know we're halfway through the program and if uh, the truth be told for a lot of people then it's going to be too late to reach the goal that you've set yourself within the six weeks if it takes us two or three weeks to get started so you know what, what to measure? It's kind of fairly simple. We're going to measure your body weight. Ideally, first thing in the morning, if you can't do that, obviously you can use the scales at the gym, but ideally we'd do this at home first thing in the morning. That's your true weight. We want to do that every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And then what we want to really have a look at is the averages. So most people will lose weight between Monday and Friday. And if we can maintain that weight, uh, our Friday weight, over the weekend, we are on to a winner, okay? The next thing then that we'll have a look at is waist to hip ratio. We'll do that every uh, kind of three weeks, maybe once at the beginning, once at the midway point, once at the end. In terms of our body fat percentage, again, we'll do that on week one, week three, and week six. We'll take progress pictures on week one, three, and six, and we will take nutritional pictures every single day. So again, taking out your iPhone, take a picture of everything you eat, put that together as a collage, and then put that collage up into the Facebook group daily. So we're using our body weight, we're using our waist to hip ratio, we're using body fat percentage, we're using progress pictures, all as a kind of a collective to make sure that we are heading in the right direction. And then obviously we're using the nutrition pictures to keep ourselves accountable. So in terms of the measurements, what I want you to do is fill out those forms which are down below this video every Sunday. So there's one that's going to be body, uh, your body weight, your waist to hip ratio, that type of thing. And there's another one which is going to be nutrition tracking. So we'll fill them out every Sunday. And guys, as always, if you have any questions, hit us up ASAP.